The default system font on both Windows 10 and 11 is Sego UI. However, you have the option to personalize your system by changing the font to one of your liking. This simple task can give your system a fresh and updated appearance, making it feel new and invigorating. Before proceeding, it's crucial to identify and make a note of the precise name of the font you intend to use as the system font. Open the Run dialog box and go to the font's location. Here, find the font you want to use and note down its name. You can also install new fonts from Microsoft Store. I'm going to use the Calibri font myself. Next open the Registry Editor. You can do this by pressing the Windows key plus R to open the Run dialog or you can search for it in the search box, then type Regedit and hit Enter. Once the Registry Editor is open, navigate to the following folder. Now, you'll see a list of font substitutes on the right side. Locate the font you wish to designate as the system font and record its exact value, including the extension, under the data column. For instance, if you wish to use Calibri as your new system font, make sure to note it down. The next essential step involves backing up the registry. Instead of creating a comprehensive backup, we'll focus on backing up the specific keys. This method allows for easy restoration when you decide to revert to the default system font. To modify the default system font in Windows, we need to ensure that Windows recognizes the font we select. Begin by opening the Start menu, searching for Notepad, and clicking on the top result to launch the Notepad program. Copy and paste the following script into Notepad, replacing your font name with the name of the font you desire, including its extension. Navigate to the File Explorer. Locate the directory where you stored the file, right-click on it, and choose Open or Merge from the Context menu. Finally, reboot your PC to implement the changes. Once your computer has restarted, you should see the new system font applied throughout Windows.
To return to using the default system font, simply access the backups you created earlier and open or merge them. This action will restore the original font settings, reverting your system to its default configuration. After that restart the system. After restoring the two files and restarting the system the font will revert to the default for Windows as you can see. And there you have it. That's how you can change the system font in Windows 11 and Windows 10 using the registry. Remember, be cautious when making changes to the registry and always back up your system before making any modifications. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.